organizations that do the same in different countries, Tanzania and Mozambique, whereby we do communicate with each other on the numbers that are being cited. And the interesting thing is this year we started our land-based surveys on 15th July and we have so far seen quite a bigger number of 10 um, 10 reports and talking about reports this report can in a day it can be one report but then the report can be can comprise of different animals it could be 10 animals it could be 11 animals so out of these 10 reports we have had uh, 16 individual wells that have been counted and the types of wells that we see in our waters are the humbuck wells those are the ones that uh, migrate to our coast and we are still building up um, the motivation for people to uh, come down and see and each day our team sees uh, reports any sighting of the wells we do put it on our social media and people can then uh, make um, make the decision and so far we have had few people calling in to ask about how they can do um, the whale watching and how they can as well as stay safe so our job apart from just uh, marketing whale well watching it's also trying to look at human uh, safety aspects and we are trying to encourage people a lot to follow the uh, COVID regulations that have been put into place so that we, um, we can make sure they are safe during the whale watching and as well 